kids? I'm back with another Miles stat. This time I got the Scout Rover. It includes Leo, Callisto, and it includes some missile and some spinning wheels on the back. That's Leo. How you can connect the Stellar Sphere engines to it. And includes missiles, launching, and here's the Miles logo, right there. So let's open this up. Let's take it out. Ooh, see it has an opening window. So kids, this is the Scout Rover. Leah. Miles is dad. But well, here are the missiles that it includes. Here. How do you want to fire the missiles? I don't think they're missiles. I think they're called. Let me read on the box. Push down to release flash beams. How? We've seen the Star Jetter. Be sure to check out that video. At the end of our clip, click the eye above for that. We've also seen the Space Guard Cruiser. We have that video. If you click on the eye above, there's a link to it. And today we're going to take a look at the rover. This is a Scout rover and it also has a launching beam as well. It launches flash beams right from here. And this one includes Leo, so that's Miles' dad. He's an engineer. And this is an exploratory rover. It actually scouts or explores any surface of a planet. It's a really fun vehicle. It has a top that actually opens. There are two seats in here so it can seat another person, another figurine. And it also includes Leo. And he has his spacesuit on, including this helmet so he can explore outer space. And remember, there's no oxygen in outer space, so he needs that to breathe. This is not removable, so it does not come off. The rover is very fun and simple. It actually has wheels in the back that come up. So if you press down, the rover actually is more flat to the ground. But if there's a rocky terrain, you can lift the wheels just like this. So the rover can pass any rocks or surfaces that are more bumpy. This one does not have any sounds to it. It's more basic, but it has a wheel. And here are the flash beams that actually fit right into the rover. You press the button here and the wheels lower. Or you can just lift them up. Oh, you have to put these up. Then, oh. Maybe I didn't put the flash beam in, beams incorrectly. Whoa. How did you press down? Yeah, and then... Hey guys, I'm Leo. I'm Miles' dad. And I use this rover to explore any planet. It's very handy. The flash beams are helpful when I need to fire a flare. So let me load one up for you and show you how it works. There's a space for it right down here. Make sure the vehicle is lifted before you fire the flares. And then just press down. After you press down, the flares fire. Let's see that again. So load the missiles. Make sure you press them in all the way. So the vehicle needs to be in the upright position or in the up position. When you load the missiles, 
Then you press down on the vehicle and the missiles or the flares fire. And that's how it's done, kids. Hey, Dad. Nice job, Dad. Thank you, son. That was a great tour of your rover. Yeah, you should come ride it with me. Come on, let's go. Don't forget to load the flares. We're ready to explore. That's it for us guys. Thanks so much for watching. Be sure to give it a thumbs up if you like this video. Subscribe and watch more by clicking the I above. Bye everybody.